Hi, my name's Andrew Campbell, and I'm the Digital Commissioning Editor for The Mind Course. For both the British English and the American English versions of the course, there are the standard digital components that you'd expect, like an interactive whiteboard version of the student's book for classroom presentation use. For me, what's really great about the course are the online workbooks, the videos, and the resource centres for teachers and for students. So the online workbooks. Now, these are interactive versions of the print workbooks um, and they fully support the students' books. They sit on the Macmillan Big Tree platform and there are interactive activities, audio and video. They are a great way of helping students take control of their learning. Students can use them on the move, on a mobile, on a tablet, as well as a computer. Plus, there's the ability to have instant feedback on answers, so you can check what you're doing and you can try again if you want to. And there's a, a very easy to use gradebook feature, which means teachers and students can check progress and check scores. As for the videos, we've produced some really eye-catching new videos for Mind. We've got a mix of interview style, magazine style and documentary style videos, and each one matches a corresponding unit in a student's book. We've taken a topic or a theme from that unit and we've developed it in an interesting way. So the videos are fantastic for lesson lead-ins and for sparking discussions. For example, we've got documentaries about Paralympic athletes, about the rise of social media, about talent shows. We've got interviews about career choices, about starting your own business, about the generation gap between young adults and their grandparents. The other thing that is outstanding about the MIND course and its digital components are the resource centres for students and for teachers. For every level there's a student's resource centre and there's a teacher's resource centre and this is where the supporting material for the course sits. So for the students there's all the audio from the student's book, there's all the audio from the workbook, there's all the videos, there are video self-study worksheets, and for every unit there are word lists and there are checklists. For the teachers, there's all that same material that there is for the students, plus there are additional life skills lessons to support the life skills in the student's book. There are additional worksheets and teacher notes for use in the classroom, and there's a full range of testing options from placement test to unit tests, mid-course tests and an end-of-course test. Thank you.